Hi there, Miss Nicole here. Today we're going to be reading If Dominican Were a Color, written by Celia Recio, illustrated by Brianna McCarthy. Read with permission from Simon & Schuster Books. If Dominican were a color, it would be the sunset in the sky, blazing red and burning bright. The shade of cinnamon in your cocoa, the drums beating so fast, they drive you loco. My grandma's mahogany skin, honey brown eyes, my other grandma's yellow tint, just like mine. If Dominican were a color, it would be the shades of orange in the sunrise's hue, the Haitian black on my Dominican back. The deep green tints that carry the palm tree shades, the memories in your head that never fade. The neutral browns that color our lips, the cafe con leche that everyone sips. If Dominican were a color, it'd be merengue hips swaying when I walk the chatter of neighbors strutting as they talk. It'd be the way my words shape in my mouth, the color they might not know in the South. It would be the hopscotch from my Nines and counting jacks from one to the yes. It'd be the curls and kinks that blend my hair, the color of charcoal mixed with the sun's glare. If Dominican were a color, it'd be the roar of the ocean in the deep of night with the moon beaming down rays of sheer delight. It'd be the maize coming up amarillo with green. It'd be the blue-black you only see in a dream. There wouldn't be a palette that could hold it all. It'd be the seasons put together. Summer, winter, spring, and fall. That was If Dominican Were a Color, written by Silly Recio, illustrated by Brianna McCarthy. <laughs>